Okay, let's start here. We have an 82 year old woman with a 20 year history of urinary incontinence has had a mild exacerbation of her symptoms over the past three months. Urine loss generally occurs when she is carrying out daily activities such as shopping or driving and is not affected by coughing or sneezing. She underwent appendectomy at the age of 24 years. She has one daughter. She takes no medications. Pelvic examination shows an atrophic cervix without a palpable uterus or an adnexal mass. Laboratory studies are shown on the side which of the following is the most likely cause of this patient's urinary incontinence. The answer choices include A. Detrusor instability B. Hyperglycemia C. Neurogenic bladder D. Obstructive uropathy or E. Urinary tract infection You can pause and answer this question. Unpause and check for the correct answer. Okay, the correct answer here is A. Detrusor instability This patient has urge incontinence, which is commonly caused by detrusor instability. This is opposed to stress incontinence, the other most common type, which is worsened by abdominal pressure, coughing, laughing, etc., and can be caused by pelvic floor prolapse, secondary to multiple childbirths, etc. Also, it is good to keep in mind that Neurogenic bladder can cause overflow incontinence.